lot. If you could please return my call. Um, I bought a waterbed from you, and I also bought a dresser that I never picked up. And so I wanted to come by and pick up the dresser. If you could please return my call. My cell phone number is... Resave. End of messages. While your party is reached. Hello? Hi, uh, this is Igor. I'm calling for Darla about your waterbed and dresser. Uh-huh. Uh, how you doing? I'm fine. How are you? Oh, good, good. Um, so, uh, what, 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 can I, what can I help you with? Yes. Are are you happy? Are you happy with it? Uh huh. Well, I I I've been talking to my partner, and uh, it, we've been we wanted to give you the option of trading that waterbed in uh, for a superior model if you're interested. I have it right here. This one is absolutely fabulous, and not not to get too personal or anything, but I just did as, as you Americans say the the nasty with my wife Olga on it, and oh my God, what a wild ride! Okay. I again, I, I I'm from the you know the old country in Russia, and we sometimes we wear our hearts on our sleeves and we say too much. But I got to be honest, I stuffed her like a Thanksgiving turkey, and I haven't heard her scream that loud since the Bolshevik uprising. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I mean, you you should have seen my babushkas. She told me she's never seen them that red and swollen. But you know, I I'm I'm just a salesman. I don't want you to take my word for it. Feel free to bring your husband by and have her go for yourself, and yeah, we're happy to make the trade for you. It's absolutely no problem. But as I said, I was you know dangling my sweaty babushkas on the mattress, so I'll I'll clean it off with a little armor all if you if that's okay. Okay. So uh, so you want the dresser, is that right? Uh huh. Well, I can't remember what you paid for it. Um, twenty dollars. Twenty dollars. Well, we were. I was talking to my partner, and we decided it's worth about fifty dollars more than that. Okay. So you know, I and I know t money's tight right now in the, the economy and everything. But there's you know there's another way we can go here. My my son who just turned sixteen is a little shy around women, and uh, therefore he hasn't had any, had any luck there. Uh, and again, please excuse my, my forwardness coming from the old country. Uh, we were hoping maybe that you could, you know, in exchange for the dresser, you could maybe show him the ropes a bit. <laughs> I think I'll pass on that. Oh, he's good looking. I, I, I think you Americans call it hitting a home run. I, I'm not sure. I, you know, I haven't been in this country very long. But don't, don't at all feel pressured that you need to go it all the way. I mean, he's a young guy. He's very good looking. Maybe just a little under the sweater action, or you know, perhaps some 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 dry humping, old world style. That would really make his day. So do we have I'll pass, it? I'll pass you, you on get, that. I mean, uh, I, I, it saddens me to hear you say that. He's such a good boy. If, if you know, if the mood strikes, by my, by all means, go for it. You know, and don't worry. The stereotypical. The things that you hear about Russian men are absolutely not true. We are hung like hamsters. So it's, you know, in fact, his fully erect Yeltsin is easily fits in the palm of my hand. There's no worries about stretching, etc. Do we have a deal? Um, no, I'll pass on that. Okay, so what, what can I, if, you, if you're passing up all those, how, how can I help you? You just want to come pick up the dresser? Yeah. Okay. Okay. It, would it be okay if, if uh, you know, my son Vladimir meets you and maybe you know kisses you goodbye because it is his dresser. And he, he. Okay. Sure. He's gonna miss it and you know he wants to be sure that it's it's in good hands. I he, think my I think my daughter might like him more than I might like him. Oh, so. really? is that right? How old is your daughter? Twelve. Well, that yeah, twelve is a little. I mean, he's sixteen. Yeah. He, to be honest with you, he's got a little bit of crush on you and. Because he's parting, I know he's. We're we're from an old country. Because he's parting with the dresser, he, he you know it's it was his grandmother's dresser. He inherited it. He he may want to kiss you goodbye and just you know make sure that you take good care of it. Okay. Okay. So um, you're gonna wear lipstick, right? Because he has never had uh -huh. lipstick on his cheeks. He, I think he'd look real cute with some lipstick. Okay. 
Okay, well that sounds good. Um, I, I think we have a deal, so so Vladimir will be waiting and maybe a little over the sweater action while you're here, or, or what do you say? Okay, so where are you located? Uh, well, it, it depends. We're, we have located in a number of locations. We have a number of outlets, and uh, let, let me tell what's easiest for you? I mean, is it okay if, we'll, if, he, if he maybe does a little over the sweater action? No. Oh, are you sure? Because he's a very good boy. He gets. Yes, I'm he, sure. He has a solid C minus average in, in in his classes, and I'm very proud of him. Okay, so where are you located at? Uh, well, can you hold on a second? I have another call. Okay. Thank you. Hello, are you, are, are you there, Darla? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry to keep you waiting. That was my son, Vlad, again. Uh, I, I just told him that, that, you know, we're selling his dresser, and uh, he just wants to meet you and shake your hand and maybe maybe do, a you know, like a three- or four-second French with you. Is that okay? No. Okay, okay. So where are we located? Um, where wh What highway are you closest to? 10 Freeway. The 10. And where are you coming from exactly? Loma Linda. Loma Linda. Uh, do, you, do you know how to use Google Maps? Yeah. Okay, because my son's real good with Google Maps. Uh, to be honest with you, though, because he's 16, he couldn't find the G-spot with Google's, Google Maps or Yahoo. You know what I'm talking about? No. Okay, all right. Well, uh, his sense of direction is really bad. Uh, he, just, he would have a hell of a time finding a G-spot with Yahoo Maps. Yahoo! <laughs> Okay, so we are located in uh, Los Angeles area. Are you familiar with Hancock Park? No. Uh, how, how, okay, Hancock Park. Um, uh, are you in front of a laptop right now? Yeah. Okay, let me, let me tell you. Do you know how to get to Google Maps? Yeah. Okay, before you go there, though, okay, so you, you load up Internet Explorer, or whatever you have available there. Uh, I want you to go to my son's website, Vlad, because, it, I mean, before you pass on him, I know he's a little young, but he's a good guy. Uh, you, you've got to see his Golovkin. It's just, it's progressing so well for his age. Okay. Okay, so let's go to Google Maps, and, uh, you know, maybe maybe after we find out where you're going, where you're heading, we can have you go visit Vladimir's website. Uh, and, then, and then and then when you come by, maybe you guys can hang out a little bit, uh, drink some old world tea or coffee, and... You know, we'll see what happens. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay. So uh, you're in front of Google Maps, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's type in your address because I want to. Uh, Vladimir knows, uh, you know, because he's giving up his dress, so he probably wants to send you a bouquet of flowers or you know some sexual to toys, etc. So we, we probably need your address at least to put it in the file, you know, for because there is a warranty on the dresser. You know, if there's anything wrong with it, like I said, with a with a mattress, you can bring it back. And an exchange is is fine. You may have to sweet talk Vlad into that exchange, but hey, I mean, this this is how the world works. Okay. All right, so Darla, I'm going to have to give you a call back. Uh, I got another call, and it looks like it's uh, Olga. Um, I, I think she's still reeling from last night's Bolshevik uprising. So let me give you a call back, and then I'll hook you up with the directions, and we should be able to make this transaction today. Does that sound good? Okay. Okay, so uh, I'll, I'll talk to you later, and Vladimir sends his love. Okay. All right, bye-bye.